So if you're thinking about upgrading your phone, this is a decision you don't want to rush. The OnePlus 13 is just around the corner, and it's bringing some cool new features that you might want to wait for. In this video, we'll be looking at what OnePlus has added and upgraded in the OnePlus 13 and whether you should wait for it or just go ahead and buy the OnePlus 12. By the end of 2024, we'll have some awesome flagship phones coming out, packed with the latest A features and new technologies to keep you on trend in 2025. The OnePlus 13 is going to be one of them. First, the design is set to be sleeker and more premium than ever. The new BOE X2 quad curve display is expected to be beautiful. The exciting part is that recent rumors are circulating about Snapdragon teasing a video for the 8 Gen 4, featuring an initial look at the OnePlus 13 with a circular camera module. There's no confirmation from OnePlus yet, but judging from the design, it might be the On E Plus 13. And if the rumors are true, the performance will be off the charts. We're talking about the latest Snapdragon 8 Elite chip, which means faster speed and better multitasking. We'll learn more about the CPU when the OnePlus 13 launches and how the company has optimized it for ongoing trends. But what's even more exciting is the wireless magnetic charging. Yep, just like some of the premium flagships, you'll be able to charge your OnePlus 13 magnetically. That's super convenient, and it looks like OnePlus is making a strong comeback to win back the customers they lost in recent years. And let's not forget the camera. Every year, OnePlus steps up its game, and the OnePlus 13 is expected to deliver even better photo quality with improved low-light shots and more detailed images. Don't forget the Hasselblad collaboration, which helps the OnePlus 13 take even more natural photos. So should you wait for the OnePlus 13? Well, if you're someone who loves having the latest and greatest tech, I'd say yes. The OnePlus 13 is shaping up to be a real game changer. But if you're happy with your current phone and don't mind missing out on the newest features, then you might not need to rush. It's all about what you need in a smartphone. What do you think? Will you wait for the OnePlus 13 or stick with your current phone? Let me know in the comments below.